How are you doing, everyone? Uh, thanks for taking the time out of your busy day to come see this. I thought this would be a lot more fun. It shoot a really great video here on a gorgeous day in Vancouver. You get the beautiful Burrard Street Bridge in the background. But uh, outside that, I got my Winnipeg Jets shirt on. Go, Jets, go. Oh, we're so close to clinching that first playoff spot in 20 years. Oh, guys, exciting, exciting. So, I thought I'd do this instead of some huge, long, boring email, uh, which a lot of you don't read, I know, because I've talked to you. This thing on. Hello? So I'm trying to be a little more creative here and do a fun little video and talk as fast as I can so you don't fall asleep or turn it off. Uh, so here's the deal. I got two huge things to tell you. Uh, a big milestone. But bikers coming by, so this is what makes this interesting. Live TV, folks. Live TV. A uh, really cool win that I had this year. My first job of the year was working with Cameron Crowe. And no, that's not James Cameron, everyone. I've talked to a lot of people and they think it's the same guy who did Titanic and... Uh, you know, Avatar, the Terminator movies, the best. Now that, that's James Cameron. Now hold on to the railing. Keep your eyes closed, don't pee. I'm not. I'm flying! Jack! Cameron Crowe. Cameron Crowe. Cameron Crowe is the guy that did... Uh, Save It Priving Ryan and uh, E.T. No, I'm, I'm just kidding. Jerry Maguire, Vanilla Sky, Almost Famous, um, Say Anything. A Teen Jinx movie that started all, Sex Romp, Fast Time to Ridge One Hot. Come on, Spicoli, just put the shirts back on. You see that sign? No shirt, no shoes, no dice. <laughs> So, Cameron Crowe, amazing, amazing guy. Uh, one of the reasons it makes working in this industry so cool is you get to work with guys like this. Uh, so unbelievable. Very, very, very sweet gentleman. Uh, it was just a thrill to work with him. It's a new show called Roadies. It's going to be showing on Showtime sometime in the new year. And uh, starring Luke Wilson, Christina Hendricks, and a whole slew of other cool peeps. And, uh, and me, I'm in it. I'm one of the stars, though, but... Soon to be, maybe. I've pitched to Cameron to <laughs> move me. Okay. Uh, this is just for kicks. How you doing, guys? How's it going? How's it going? Just consulting with the DFP here. Uh, yeah, maybe get a 40 on that. So, why was that cool outside of being with Cameron Crowe and working with all these really great people? It was my, put the insert here, 100th job. Yeah. Very cool. 100 jobs. Uh, just goes to prove that uh, someone can actually do 100 professional jobs in this industry and you don't know who the hell he is. <laughs> it's like me. You don't know who I am. Well, you do, but maybe you forward this to somebody like, who's this guy? Um... So that's really cool, 100 professional jobs. It took me uh, 13 years or something to do that. Uh, there were some lean years in there. Oh, baby! Oh, baby. Uh, things have been going well recently, but anyway, it, it's very cool. Uh, it's hard to believe. Uh, I was, but definitely this last few years with Fargo and... <sighs> hey, you remember the story I told you of the boy I put in the oil drum and rolled onto the highway? Is that him, Dad? Yeah, Dad, is that him? <laughs> oh, you betcha. <laughs> Good old Lester Pencil Dick. So, it's pretty cool. I've, if you go to my IMDb right now, you're gonna see 40 jobs booked. I've done a lot of commercials. That's how I started my career. Maybe I'll insert some Sizzler commercials that I've done, or my Bud Light commercial. Medium, hot, and three alarm radioactive fireball surprise. Okay. <laughs> Nevertheless, a uh, hundred jobs, very cool, very cool way to start the year. Uh, right now I'm working on a Disney movie, which is great, with my lovely wife, Gabriel M Miller, who owns Love it, uh, from Corner Gas. And 
Uh, what else do I got to say? That's the big thing. So I just wanted to kind of say that. This is very cool. Uh, I have another garage sale mystery movie coming out in April. We're shooting one in April as well. And just kind of moving on from there. So uh, outside of that, go Jets go. Thanks. Huge milestone. Upward and onward. And here's to me being in the new summer version of The Walking Dead. Let's just all put that there. Um, even if it's just as one of the zombies, I'll do it. Thank you, everyone. Bye from English Bay, Vancouver. Very curly hair today. It's like extra curly on top. That's what happens around this length, you know? I'm very self conscious of my hair. Hey, you. Remember me? Remember me?